Welcome back, everyone. Ewok Templar Industria. I've switched to mouse and keyboard because I really need this accuracy. Because <laughs> without that sticky ridicule, I mean, the controls are already kind of weird anyway. I feel like this is a little bit... This is better. It's just better. A little bit more fluid, I think. Yeah. Any real, real quick. Before we move on to the next area, I decided to backtrack a little bit just to see if I could touch those pages or grab some ammo, and I, I could. I actually picked up the page so I could read them, but I also noticed this. I completely missed this. This was in the middle of the beginning area for this chapter. Bolt action rifle. Oh, if this doesn't one-shot one of the jumpy boys with the machine guns, I'm going to be a little bit disappointed, but we we got it now. Also, I mean, that's just going to help us out all together. Real quick, let's go ahead and read these two more entries, because I'm curious about what they say. This one's called A New King. This is the one that was in the bar. Uh, the Election. The man from another place will be the opposing candidate to uh, rival King Dominique III at a public rally in the Institute of Applied Science. Pakovic uh, Rosendahl explained that Pakovic's only hope is a clear step against the incoming threat he calls Atlas. He further showed any uh, many fundamental changing innovations, including a completely new energy source that could outrun coal and steam energy by far. The latest unhappiness of the people of Pakovic uh, play into Rosendahl's hands. If Rosendahl wins the election, the city can expect many fundamental changes. If he loses, Dominique the Third needs to show his strength against the ongoing events. All right. Now this one, this is the one that was found, that was over there, on the the top floor area where I got that one health sliver. Uh, health vial. Sorry. Anywho. 1994. Dear Mother, first of all, I am he I'm healthy and well. The cold is gone and I am feeling more alive than ever. You asked how our city changed lately with this new king we have. His name is Rosadol, and I can tell you, a lot has changed. For the good. Since I attended the big demonstration of the new energy source, one invention after the other was introduced into our public life. It started with the electrical seat lamps. You can't imagine how bright they are. I'm writing underneath an electrical light on my desk, all free of charge. No more coal dust, clear, clearer air, and a quiet city. Quieter city. Hope you will visit us soon. My sister and I can hardly wait. In love, Annie Marie. Oh, it's just the love they all know. Technology came. And it came fast. Wait, so are we in another world or not? Because I could swear the world that I'm from already had electricity everywhere. This guy going to the past too? I didn't pick up on that. Did he so technically did we come back to like a time when did we come back to literally oh no no it says 2024. Oh wait, that's the say that's the actual date of when I'm saving. Never mind, that's that's my date. That's not Ah, uh, silly. Hold on. Anything back here? No? Alright. I forgot. When you grab things, your flashlight will go out. It's really dark in here. I'm gonna keep my flashlight on for now. Hopefully we'll run into a battery soon. I think I see some stuff over here. This place looks surprisingly big. Wraps around over here. Is there nothing over here? Come on, dude. One flashlight battery. 
is being consumed so fast. Well, I'm gonna run in the dark for a second. Up the stairs. There's gotta be something. What the? I didn't even see. I didn't even see what activated. Oh. There are some dudes down there. I guess I'm supposed to jump in there? Lucky for me, they're shiny enough. That's <laughs> where I can hit them now. Also, with the mouse and keyboard, this makes this child's play. I can snipe them, basically. I'm still not going to risk it, though. I'm going to wait for them to do their weird stop-moving thing. He's smoky now. Oh, yeah. It's all coming together. Yeah. We need to backtrack, though. I think the battery should have lasted longer. Or you should be able to keep, carry more than one. Anything over here? No? Dang it. At some point, I'm just going to have to brave the dark. I really hope not. Because then we'll probably die. What is happening? Another one. Yeah, that's why I just ended you. I don't have time for that. <laughs> I don't have time to be fighting self-destructo bots in the dark. Alright, I guess now is the time to go down there. The one good thing about it is that items that I can collect glow in the dark a little bit. They have their own unnatural light source. I assume I actually need to go this way somehow. No, oh, that's where I came from. This is a dead end. Is that a staircase over here? It is. Okay. We wrap around this generator. It's sorry, it's just gonna be a little bit dark for a second. I am legitly running low on battery for the flashlight. Oh really? What's this? It's a valve wheel. I have no idea where it goes either. Where could it go? This is kind of creepy now.
kind of force creepiness though. Where could this possibly go? Hold on, do I have a uh, information? These are notes. What's the diary say? The cables might lead me. The bananas has gone bad. All right. I have to reload because whatever this is, I'm not going to be able to do it in the dark. This would hurt, right? This is too high. It has to be something over here, right? There it is. Yeah, it has to be this. Thank God. Does it mean the battery is also brighter when you have a fresh <laughs> one, too? Game Savade. Oh, they have these weird anti door spiders going around, too. Okay. I don't like that sound, so I'm just gonna whip this out for a second to make me feel better. A solid save point as well. I like that. But I also slightly dislike it. Any more supplies? No? No, I think about it. I wonder what the range is. I got eyes on Town Hall. It's close. Well then, don't get yourself killed at the last hurdle. Just up that hill, and you're there. Thanks for the heads up, old man. Oh, anytime. Oh. What are the odds? <laughs> There's a rifle here waiting for me. I didn't even see it. I, I'm assuming there was probably one leaning against that thing again. I want to get a little bit closer, though. I don't want to waste my shots. Hold on, let's go ahead and take out this boy, though. He doesn't know how stairs work. Oh, God. A little one, too? You know what? They're moving around a lot, but I have the advantage because they don't know how this staircase works. Wait for it. Keep an eye on all of them. That's one of them. I think he finally figured it out. No, he didn't. Dang, he's healthy, though. Gotta give him that. <laughs> A game of patience, really. I 
And then you think I could take all these shots? I could. I don't want to waste any shots, though. I want to get it cleanly. There you go. All right, he's down. This one, he's having his own party. We have pistol rounds, though. Nice. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and save, because we did that so cleanly. Step by step, inch by inch. Even though now that I'm using mouse and keyboard, having a way easier time aiming, I still remember how bad they, that those machine gun ones kicked my butt. All right, they put me all over the place. Is this where I came from? No, it's not. Better advantage point, too. Oh, rifle cartridges. How big is my rifle cartridge? Four. Good to know. Hold on. Let's reload everything. I want to be ready for them. These tiny ro these robot men aren't going to catch me slipping. One more should do it. No? I there you go. Alright, it was two more. I can't blame her. She's obviously just some science woman. This is her first time being introduced to guns. I'll supply her first time fighting robots. Murderous robots that are semi-sentient. So we're gonna give her a lot of forgiveness. Well, that's creepy. But I, I guess she is an explorer of sorts. Doesn't go that far deep in. Ammo full? What kind of ammo is it? Whatever it is, I'm full of it. Kind of look like pistol rounds. Ow, ow, ow! That's alright. That's why she's got mad leaps. Aha! You're no match for a tiny fence, are you? Uh, it seems like things have turned into Call of Duty all of a sudden. And that one's gone. I wish I mem memorized all the lines from Saber Private Ryan so I can go to the weird speeches about God, give me strength <laughs> and guide my bullets. These robots have already been shot. I'm just helping them. Oh, God, their range is good. He saw me through the box, too. Hold on. No, no. Why? How? All right, all right. That's right. Aha! Uh -huh. He's confused now. This feels good, though. Not gonna lie. I'm glad I have this for these guys now. I kind of needed it. Because these machine gun wielding ones with their stupid machine gun hands. Oh, one is close by. Is it in that building? Sounds like it, right? Oh, their bodies doing their weird rattling. I'm still kind of alive thing. Oh, shotgun ammo. We're full on that. Now oh, they gave me a decent amount of ammo to refill up on. Actually, look at this. There's still one way down range. I ain't gonna risk it. Oh yeah, there's one in that building, all right. What's that? Well, well. That's just the sound that device is making down there. Oh, 
I don't like it. It makes me concerned. What about this guy? Does he die in one sniper shot? Well. Say what you want about the powers that be. They apparently made bulletproof glass. I didn't even hit him. Ooh, a record. More sniper rounds. Oh, crap. Ah, always a critic. Where are you running? Why are you running? Yeah, there's a lot of robots over here. Feels a little bit more well fast paced. You know what I mean? Hold on. We might as well go over here and kill this one. I don't want to wait around for them to have a good time. Surprise. A woman appears. Might as well play the record now. I think the records are just collectibles at this point, right? Oh, Blue Edge, it's the same record. Is that her favorite song or something? Or the one song the king made legal? <laughs> we only get one song we have to share. All right. Damn it, king. Come on, dude. Can we get some more songs other than this Blue Knight stuff? That made me feel really good. Not gonna lie. She's starting to become one with the bullet now. She's beginning to believe in herself. Her aim is becoming true, true. Is that a health file? Kicking it thrill house style now. Oh. Alright. Everything's pretty much full except for SMG. Just gonna hop over this. Can I not go, can I go back? Is this unhoppable? No. It's not. It's just a trick to make you think it's unhoppable. I'll show you. You gotta use skateboard moves. See that? Now aim for the bushes. Aha! There's some G bullets. You know what? Since I'm over here, we might as well go save again. No. Oh, oh. I will cheese you. Oh. I wish the pickaxe did more damage. Get you that anti armor pickaxe. I guess that would technically be like an old school Warhammer. Some sort of pick hammer. Reinforce. Beaded and gilded in the. Bathed and blessed in the watery lakes of Minnetonga. Oh, there was SMG right here. Oh, hold on. I think we got most of them, or all of them. But every avenue that's explored. I'm missing this box somehow. Is there something on the wall? Oh, it's just the newspapers. I thought there was something glowing on the wall. Alright, it's locked. We're doing all right. Doing way better now. Oh God! I had to say something. I had to say something. How? How was it? Was it running towards me while it exploded? I had to say something. As soon as I said it, ah, oh, we're doing good. Look at this. Look how many there are. 
God bless, I was hoping to save up to three and be cool. All right. Those ones are backing off. How do we lose this war? I'm an untrained science woman. What, what Gordon Freeman <laughs> nonsense is this? He was trained to use the gravity gun and nothing else, man. Somehow that translated to being a master of bullets. Then again, that each HEV suit was pretty badass, right? So it probably enhanced his aiming abilities, right? Alright. Eventually they'll calm down and make a mistake. Like that. And he's gonna freak out. Be like, where'd that shot come from? For a little bit. Then eventually, he too will make a mistake. I'm waiting right here for him. I think that's a spot for him. <laughs> yeah, he's looking at the body. Alright, this is the last time I'm gonna come back here and save again, alright? Getting tired. Three? That was a bit mean. As soon as I came up that hill, two self destructo balls that could run as fast as I can run and could explode while running. I thought they had to stop to explode. Didn't know that. And then three machine gun guys came out. Not so bad. But at the same time, it's terrible. Terrible. Just terrible. Got to reload this. Seriously, though, can I get some armor made of their bones? Or something? <laughs> ah! Really? There's another one? Jesus. Where? Is he coming over here? This one's right there. He's still alive. <laughs> Hit him in the head. He just tucked and ducked it. There you are, you son of a gun. <laughs> Getting tired of these robots, man. Getting tired of them. Nothing? No? That's another mini bot. Oh, he's over there already, being a freak. I mean, relatively speaking. She's still pretty badass, right? Nora is handling this entire situation fairly well. It's as if all of her life she was preparing to go through a teleporter to an alternate dimension that had been taken over by these steampunk robots from the movie 9. What? Alright, well that would explain how we lost.
Is that the thing they were talking about? What? Was it even real? Why the sad guitar music? Just to show me this attack on Titan machine. That thing was bigger than Liberty Prime. I mean, Liberty Prime's like five or six stories. That thing was like... I don't even know. 25? He was up there. I mean, considering how high the smoke's, how high we are right now, comparing his size to, like, the train, that thing was massive. It's taller than a mech warrior. I think I found Town Hall. Taller than an armored core. I'm quite curious to know what's in there after all these years. Hopefully not too many things that want to kill me. Like, oh, all these robots were here, and all they had to do was go around that corner and go up the staircase. And they could have made it to the last bastion where the humans were. Or at least this guy. This handicapped old man who's somehow good at stealth. Even though he <laughs> is confined to a wheelchair, maybe? Or that was, was that someone else we ran into? First things first. Well, these people have been dead a while. These two aren't self-destructive, which means someone shot them to death before they could explode. Boss gang, exit. Oh, don't mind if I do. Anything else behind this counter? Bullets, drugs, coffee? Never cleaned up the bones of the dead robots, eh? More of a man who can walk some uh, problem, huh? Why would the robots turn the electricity off, though? Because they don't need it. They rely on battery power and they go to recharge stations. It's like they know. Oh. He's not in here. Or maybe he is, because that goes... That goes on. Save my data, then. What's... What was in the other door? What was the other option? Just locked a bit, right? Nah. Not even an Easter egg. A single bullet? No? Don't try anything funny. End scene. What if I don't want to end scene? Well, I want to start a new scene. Bigger. Stronger. No one's here. I would have been more surprised if there was. Take a look around. Wait, you asked me to come here for uh, another reason other than to meet me? It's the president's office. Um, looks like he took the train towards the coast. North of the city? The Doom Chapel, of course. How do I get there? Well, there's a train in the town hall station. Needs filling up with water and coal, but it should still run. Okay, I will leave right now. Wait, 
you have to cross the old canal to reach the city gate. It's no man's land. Nobody's been there for a long time. Well, do I have any other choice? Yeah. Thanks for warning me, but I need to go, no matter what. All right. Just don't say I didn't warn you. Nothing else useful here. What are these love letters, huh? Was that a picture of me on the desk? So just go fill up the train and take it on to the, the old OK Corral then, huh? Oh, what the? Glad I didn't miss that. All right, let's go save. Oh, the scene ended. We can't save. We have the auto save and nothing else. Oh, there's the save. So there's a train downstairs that we can fill up. We take to the coast. I'm assuming it's actually that way that we're going. It's such a super industrialized city, it's crazy. Kind of just like, kind of looks like some place you'd find in like the back rooms, because it's sort of like sort of all misty. You can't tell how big it is. Even the map said how big it was. But the one time we see another human is like right at the beginning. Is just for a little while. He's like, "Don't, you'll die," and then he runs away. That's fine. Just interesting. R Sometimes the boxes, they move in ways that cannot be per I'm gonna weaken it right now. Oh, I'm gonna get him. I can just get up here. One weak spot of the robots. <laughs> Their inability to climb things properly. Oh, but now he's hiding over there. Also, I did not calculate whether or not I could jump back over. It worked out. Where are you going? Where are you going, little freak? You think I was gonna let you guys just get away with being little freak jobs? Now, would you hide from me? I see you. The old sniping with the pistol technique. They didn't see it coming. Neither did I. But I don't move or think like they do. The problem with robots is that they don't think like a woman. She watched all of Kenobi, I can tell. That's why she's always trying to use the high ground. Bust in. Ooh. The year was 1992. Four years ago, some forest workers saw these weird figures appearing somewhere west of Hakovic. Rumors talked about a blue light. While the story sounded almost like a fairy tale to me, I still have the feeling that this might have something to do with the new energy source. One of the engineers who built the machine told me of a similar blue light. Looks of or furniture would disappear overnight. Tools or furniture, sorry. And they worked on the machine. Another strange thing happened today, right here. I came into my living room and found a cage with a singing bird on my writing desk. How the hell did this cage get in here? Who is toying with me? I need to get rid of this bird. It's singing all day and I can barely focus. Joseph Oswald. The Diaries of a Wimpy Kid. I'm gonna leave that health there. Oh, I'm gonna 
much easier. This is how cheesing happens, sir. Damn. There we go. Alright. Don't let me forget about that health. Is it gonna calm down or is a bunch of machine gun guys gonna jump out now? This is the entire train map over here. It's having its own party. Alright, let's say this is a one-way trip, so I'm gonna go ahead and fill full up. Go grab that health. It'll be full of health. Then low on health, I say. Especially if you can't come back and get it. Juice. Alright. Let's go. In it to win it. I guess I could make a bridge with these barrels to get back up here. I don't think I need to. If I really wanted to, I could. There's not going to be a secret over there, is there? think so. I'm halfway tempted, but at the same time, this game's kind of slow paced and the save points are kind of spaced out. over there. Remember that. Actually, hold on. Didn't even think about that properly. I heard something. I heard machine sounds, but it could just be these damn eyeball things. Actually, I think I'm supposed to go this way. Huh. The range on this pistol is pretty good. Oh, now he's mad. Wow. The same science. The same logic. Hold on. He's moving back now. Stop moving, you cowards! Oh god, there's so many self-destruct robots, and there's like four! Oh, it's hell in a cell down there. He's about to go down. He's on the double smoke now. I need to get a little bit closer for those little ones, though. It's okay. Where are you gonna go? Who are you gonna call? 
Oh, they're freaking out now. That sounded like one climbing a ladder. Patiently. I think one of those little eye ones is right underneath me, too. I lose track of you after a while, maybe. friend died and soon so shall you look at him brave of him he came back to face me he was like if this is my time that I face it head on these humans aren't gonna take me out that easy There's a few way back there. There's one more red guy back there and two little dudes. What's the accuracy of the SMG like? They're all hiding now. Let's go back up. I wonder if we can coax them to come back out of here. I'm over here now. I'm just gonna, if I can cheese them, I'll cheese them. I'm a fan of provolone. Oh, he's clever. With my help, he could be the best. Where are you going? The most advanced army ever conceived. Activate that one. I have no idea where that one went now. <laughs> Once I activated him. Yes, come back to me. There he goes. There's that little one gone. Cheese. Cheese. The shredded provolone man. The mozzarella guy. The monster enthusiast. Alright. There's only one explode boy. That sounded like he was up there. Hi. Life wasn't fair to you. Aha! Oh, he's just teasing me now. Oh, come on. What are you afraid of? I thought the robots had no fear. They have no fear chip. They only know move and strategy. Oh, come on. What a tease. Yes. Ask me questions. Yes. Suffer into the water with you. Make no splash. You don't need to. <laughs> Ten point dive. Oh, another one's fond. I think after I killed them, some more spawns, all that. They jumped out of the carts. It's actually a very good idea to stay up here, then.
can be risking life and limb. These little robots that are just gonna die and come back so fast. Listen carefully. I'm mean, hearing all kinds of little noises, but I guess this game has a lot of ambient noises. I guess now's the time we start risking it. Alright, let's get down there. Nice and easy. Knowing this game, something extra might spawn now that I'm actually down here with them, too. I think they try to play this off as a stealth section, but I wasn't having it. I'll tank it and I'll turn it into a cheese section, thank you very much. What's this about? Seems pretty useless. Can I get under there? No? And yes. So how do I get the coal inside of the train? Very carefully, they assured me. Well, this looks like death. But it could also be a secret. You know this game is sometimes. No, it's not. It's just death. That'd be a hell of a thing. Do all that expert robot cheesing just to die to gravity and water. This is way more straightforward than I'm making it out to be. Because me on mouse and keyboard, the head bob is like way more intense. It's actually a little bit disorienting. I think it's because, like, you move so much when you go up, like, the little steps of the tracks. There's another red one nearby. I wonder if he's up there, not even down here. Still, though, I need to keep my whip wits about me. Yeah, that's definitely above me. We gotta figure out where we're supposed to go. I'm assuming it's over here. We were supposed to wrap around. Aha! Ooh, there's something in here, too. Oh, there's a way through here? Completely missed it. Sort of saved me some time. Try to keep in mind there's some ammo in this cart down here. I don't know if I'll be able to come back, but still. Ooh. Shotgun ammo. Oh, I see what I gotta do. I was supposed to come, I was supposed to come over here. Ooh, ooh, I don't like that. Hold on. I mean, we gotta Add some boomer shooter movement to this. Oh, he is up there, isn't he? Good for him. I guess if you were really good at the game, you wouldn't. <laughs> He's just sitting there waiting for me. Hey, come over here. 
Look at him, now he's mad. Do you know how ramps work, bro? How dare you? I am the voice of the covenant. Look at him over there. As soon as I figure out how I beams work, you're dead. You're dead, you hear me? Yeah, come over here. Dude. Am I making it hard? I just backed up a little bit and he completely lost track. I mean, he's a da I could have punched her if she had stayed on the top of that ramp. Failure. Surprisingly light and strong. Base must be aluminium. As the English say. Hmm. Hold on to nothing. Not even hopes and dreams survived in here. I heard some buzzing sounds, all right? We're not going to get be caught slipping ever again. Sometimes the safest way is to spring the trap, you know what I'm saying? Looks like a lot of people wanted to leave town, but they just couldn't. Wait, is this pretty straightforward? Do I just push a button and the thing's full of coal? And good to go? Ooh, a note! 1993. I managed to talk to a few people, representatives, and convince all of them to vote against further in industrial projects. We are all concerned that the dangerous encounters with Atlas, as Rosendor calls them, are connected with the big machine in the Institute, and not with Vivalstad, as Rosendahl states. We have a good chance to shut down the machines if we manage to find more people who are against Rosendahl's policies. Rosendahl, sorry. Politics. Or, yeah. Since November last year, I regularly find more of these caged birds in my apartment. No matter what I do, they appear out of... Nothing overnight. I don't know what to do about this. Joseph Oswald. Keeps on kidnapping birds. Going insane. <laughs> the birds are just real now. Deal with it. All right. I'm good to go. Let's say Cole's already burning in here. Well, you find your way out of there. You know, I think I might go put the kettle on. Well, it's so nice to know that someone's got your back. You're welcome. I'm just gonna have some tea and try to forget this ever happened. Is this train doing something? Has to be the quietest train. Are these just for fun? Are these just for me? Yeah, that's the horn. Oh, this turns up the speed. We're leaving this stupid town full of its dang robots. I'm gonna honk my horn and let them know I'm leaving too. Trying to see if there's any more robots out there. Oh. Darkness came and took me. Begged me to take my place among them. I did not falter. A little cog down there reminds me of the fallout little cogs. Am I right? Oh, no. I'm back in the library. Harry, Harry, Harry. You know what? It has surprisingly been like exactly... An hour. Look at all these globes. How many globes do you need? Oh, man. A nice big globe in a library would be pretty nice, how do I think about it? And places to sit and think. A really big cube-like table. 
This place has everything, and there's people falling from the sky again. Anywho, as much fun as I ha am I having now of having the accuracy and the speed of a mouse and keyboard, we're going to do a little cut right here. Thank you all. Ewok Templar, we're going through Industria. Hopefully you all enjoyed. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Hit that like button. Keep on posting. We'll see you on the next episode. Y'all take it easy.